and welcome to episode 9 of Two Crafty Stitches. Today is July 25th, 2015, and we are about a week late. Schedule and everything um, kind of got it. We don't know how to read a calendar. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then during the week, we couldn't uh, get together to do any recordings. Yes. So, I am Sandy, <laughs> also known as Nits and Bits. And I am Kelly, also known as Pearly Girl 75 And we are here... Straight from the gym. <laughs> so, which yeah. is why we're all looking like we just came from the gym. <laughs> yes. It was a very good two hours at the gym. <laughs> yeah. Intense, intense workout with our boxing and techniques and all that. And then our run through the rain. <laughs> <laughs> Here in Florida, for those of you who aren't here... We have been getting an unusual amount of rain the last week. Oh my goodness. It has the last It's like the whole days, state, too. It's not yeah. just where we are. It's like the whole state has been underwater. It is a complete <laughs> downpour. Yes. So. Yes. And and it was, it started raining, like, the this most recent bout started yesterday morning, I think. Yeah. And they're like, it's going to go through Sunday night. Oh, okay. So, Sunshine State. Sunshine State, guys. It's not our normal <laughs> summer weather where it's just the afternoon rain. I don't think we've had any normal summer weather this no. whole summer. Like, normally, because even, um, even when you just get, because usually we get rain just about every day, and we get it at some point around, like, 2 or 3 in the afternoon, like, when it gets hot enough, all of a sudden, oh, there's some rain, and then it gets really muggy and gross and whatever. Um, but even this summer, we've been getting a lot of rain in the morning instead. Like, we've had, like, a sh you know, the big yeah. rain shower in the morning, and then the rest of the day, it's muggy and gross and disgusting. But this week we've just been like waterlogged. <laughs> roads okay. are underwater and cars are stalled out on roads and I haven't been having yeah. to water any of my plants. Well, I'm good with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have, I have a friend who actually had to pull some of her plants in because they were getting too much water. She's like, I haven't planted it yet. It's still in its pot and yeah, too much water, too much rain. But anyway. <laughs> So, I have nothing new to show this time. Yeah, we're going to do so. a really quick episode. So, which we say every time, but we're being serious today. Yes. <laughs> so, you don't have anything new to show. And I have no. one new item to show, and that is my um, July shipment of the Moon Rover Fiber Club. Um, so, if you haven't gotten yours yet, I got mine a couple days ago. Look away for a minute or two. Um, and... I'm going to show it now. So here it is. You really like that green. With I the know. Purple. I really just like this green. Anyway. I know. <laughs> so any, that's the little tag. If you need to see Moon Rover Fiber Club, um, and I know well, I, I, like I just that, I love this like green. dark green. And look, it's got the brown. Yes, you know, like an orangey brown. It wouldn't be Moon Rover without. Of it. course not. Um, <laughs> so although I do have some that I bought from her that doesn't have brown in it. That I like ordered, but um, oh. but yeah, I, again, I've been very. I, I did end up re-upping my <laughs> my subscription for July, August, September. So that'll be nine months by the time I'm done that I'll have gotten this, and um, you know, I've liked it all. I haven't spun any of it. We'll have to remedy that <laughs> sometime because yeah. that hasn't happened. Um, and that's all I have for new stuff. Now, um, also, we're going off the books because of our whole schedule that's been going on, and we are slackers. Yeah, apparently. we did not do any of the notes, so we're <laughs> winging it. Improv. Yes. Improv. <laughs> so I think normally, what, we do finish objects? Um, but let's I, do, whatever, let's do finished yeah, objects. Let's do, Why not? So do you have anything? No, finished? I don't have any finished <laughs> objects. <laughs> Now, I have a bunch of finished objects, but I forgot most of them in my house. <laughs> because that's how prepared I am. Yes. I am currently not driving my car, which has one of my finished objects in there. So Because that's the place to store your finished objects. Because I, I took it into work, and then I took it out of my bag, because oh, it was okay. raining, and I didn't want to get the wool yeah. all wet. So, yeah. And um, I was more concerned about driving... In the heavy downpour mm -hmm. with the stick shift that I'm just learning how to drive <laughs> and not killing myself. Yeah. So the only thing I put in my bag 
um, that's finished is my cowl that Yay. is out of the Whisper Lace. That turned out really nice. I know. I really <laughs> like it. It's um, uh, done in the round. And, I mean, it's a nice length. I think I'm going to end up sending it to my sister if I don't steal it. Did you use all of the yarn? I did. Okay. And, like, approximately yeah. how much yarn is that? It was <laughs> over 400. I believe it was 420 yards. Okay. I mean, there there might have been, yarn. like, that much mm -hmm. left. I have some sock yarn I could probably do something like that with. I know. Yeah. I really don't need to make more socks for me. And, you know, <laughs> I like it. Yeah. And it's really light. Mm hmm I felt it yet. So, but it is very, yeah. It'll be good for our Florida. Like, I have some self striping sock it. yarn that would be really pretty in this, too. Like, yeah. how this is striping. So, um, I did block out my Morvar shawl, and that's the one that's in my car. That's the gray one. Yes. That, that you did the book review of that pattern. Well, you did the book review because yeah. you bought whatever. And it's out of your hand spun. Yes, my okay. hand spun grace. Yes. <laughs> um, and I knit that in about an, under three months. It was probably about two months and a week or so. Mm -hmm. So that was super fast for me. Yes. Um, and it kind of sat in the corner for about two weeks before I blocked it out. And then all of my uh, hand spun, that one skein, is already set, twisted, dried, and it's hanging up in my house. <laughs> so. Yes. Well, hey. Next. Yeah. Well, this gives next us stuff to talk next time. In, in like a couple weeks. It, it came out really pretty. It bloomed too. Yeah. I was very happy with we it. Were, we were discussing, because um, we're, again, we're recording a week late and a day earlier than we normally do. It's like one of those weird time vortex things, because normally we record on um, Sundays, and tomorrow is Stitch and Pitch at the Tampa Bay Rays. So we will be going there, um, which is why we don't have time to record tomorrow. Um, because we're going to, there's a yarn store that, the yarn store we talked about before, Stash, that we went to. Um, and they're having a little tailgate beforehand. Um, so I have to make some stuff to take. And um, then we're going to the game, so that's like most of tomorrow for us. <laughs> you're not even going to tell them what you're going to make? Oh, I'm making s'mores crispy treats. So they it's like, are delicious. It's like rice crispy treats, but with golden grams and like chocolate chips. And, so. and more marshmallows. And extra marshmallows, yeah, because I had to buy two bags of marshmallows, because I needed one bag and two cups. So, <laughs> luckily marshmallows are pretty cheap. Yes. <laughs> so, um... And I have a mini marshmallow. Yes. Too. And so we, um... So anyway... That's why we're recording on a Saturday, so we're just totally off our schedule. And then um, next weekend, I'm going to be at some workshops, and that would be a regular recording weekend for us if we had recorded last week. Yeah, so and we the, wouldn't have been recording next week anyway. Right, anyways, so. so maybe it worked out for the best. But then the following weekend, we might be doing again on a Saturday and posting it whenever it gets posted. <laughs> I don't know, but um, it's the summer. You know, we're getting ready to go back into the school year and everything, so, you know, things are a little wonky. What are you going to do? Um, <laughs> well, I'm not getting ready to go back. Yeah, well. Yeah. Next um, week, I am going scalloping, though, oh. and that will be a first. Yes. So, that's going to be my determining factor on what days I'm available. Yes. So, I'm excited. That's not this coming weekend, though. It's the next, the weekend that when I'm actually back in town. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, it's uh, the 6th, 7th. Right. And then coming back the 8th. And yeah. I'm going to be playing golf, which I've never done before. Ah. So that's going to be very scary. <laughs> Anybody that's in Florida, watch out. <laughs> Keep your cars away from golf courses. Yes. Yes. Is it going to be local? Um, local golf or? It's about two hours away. Oh, okay. Yeah, two hours up north. <laughs> yeah, no, you, you don't have to worry. <laughs> Yeah. I'm not gonna worry about my my car. Anymore. I will not be able to hit it that far. <laughs> so That'd be awesome. swing it. Yeah, I've only okay, played miniature golf, mm -hmm. and so you've got putting down. Only if there's like a windmill <laughs> or a scary clown. Yes. And then I've played golf on Tiger Woods Xbox, so wow. I know the terminology. Oh, okay. Good. Yes. So you know, like to yell at four, and not to yell at five. When seven. I went to a thing, we didn't do any 
be yelling out before. A lot of people don't usually yell out yeah. stuff. <laughs> so, whatever. Anyway, so, what are we working on? You can we go have first, because I'm so excited. In progress, that I actually got some work done. I was trying so hard to get this done this week for our recording, and if we'd recorded tomorrow, like, it, I probably would have it done. But, whatever. Um, <laughs> so, this is my um, Miss Winkle shawl that actually, ooh, look, I'll do a panning shot. Yes. Mm. <laughs> that I have been working on forever, but it's because I haven't been working on it. <laughs> it's just been sitting for a while. Um, so, and I have this much yarn left. It might go with me to the game tomorrow, although I can't really knit during the game, but whatever. Yes, if she knits, then... They lose. Yeah. Um, if I knit, we they win. win. So, <laughs> um, so anyway, well, maybe in the car or something. I, can, I don't know, whatever. Yeah. Um, it depends on how much I get done this afternoon and, and tonight. Because I'd really like to get this done. <laughs> Not that I don't like it, because I do. But I'm kind of ready for something else. So, um, anyway, and the yarn, which I'm totally prepared for, is... <laughs> I am, see? <laughs> is the is Cuppy Cake Yarns. Cuppy Cake Yarns. And, um, it is the Rainbow Dash colorway. And so, that's about it. It's Martina Bem's Miss Winkle, so it's got the little loops, which I get to block, which that'll be cool. And, um... I want to see how you're going to end up doing that with your, um, blocking wires. Um, no, actually there's a picture, which I will show you, because it's a paper pattern, but where you, of how you do it. Oh, okay. Yeah, pretty clever. Um, <laughs> so... Anyway, um, so that's pretty much what I've been working on this whole week. Of yeah. course, it's been like three weeks since we recorded last, but this week I've been working on this. <laughs> I can't say much for the other weeks. I am being, I'm trying to be prepared for an appeal. Oh. Because that's how awesome I am. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I didn't get that information out. <laughs> So, I'm done talking about my okay. works in progress. <laughs> so, segueing over to you. Okay, so I did start <laughs> a pair of socks last weekend, and I am almost finished with them. I'm doing them two at once. Mm -hmm. um, uh, the pattern, Can you hold them a little closer? Because it's kind of, they're, they're dark. They're dark, and it's dark, and I'm wearing I'll a very dark close. shirt. And <laughs> it, I'm medium dark. So, um, it's pretty much... I don't know if there's a pattern for it. I just kind of made it up myself, and I don't have sock blockers on. But it's just ribbed on the side. and so then it's a little stretchiness. Yeah, so that way you have a little bit more stretchy, because I don't know if I'm going to keep them or if I'm going to give them away. Um, and then I just put in a short row heel, and I am almost to where I'm going to add just uh, about an inch or so of ribbing. Mm -hmm. And... To get back to my Patton's roots because I just <laughs> needed some quick yarn. It's the Patton's uh, FX Croy in the Cascade colors. I have bought this yarn before and made some socks for my dad, but these are way too small for him. So they're <laughs> either going to go to like me or my sister. <laughs> they're going to yeah. go to myself. <laughs> Depends how I feel afterwards. But um, if I do end up shipping uh, this cow off to my sister, then I can throw the socks in there, too. And they kind of coordinate. I know. It's so. like a set. <laughs> yeah, she has been super busy and needs a little bit more time for herself because she has been uh, moving. Mm. They just uh, finished building the house, so... Um, just a little, you know, nice little surprise. It's not her birthday or anything, so. Yeah. Figured it'll be nice. Surprise in the mail, unless she's watching this episode, and then she'll know. And yeah. then she's going to be expecting it. And you're going to be like, you know, I really like this cowl. I think I'm going to keep it. Oh, and these socks are so nice, too. And she's going to be like, dude, where's my <laughs> cowl and socks? You know, I sent her a picture of a cowl, <laughs> and I, I, I was wearing it, and she's like, Wow, that's really pretty. I'm like, I know, right? <laughs> I really like it. <laughs> She'd be like, it's on video. It's on YouTube that you said that you're sending them to me. Maybe. <laughs> if anybody knows me and my mailing habits, 
it's very, very poor. Um, I, I have an issue getting to the post office and putting things in the mail. I can have it all boxed up and ready to go, and it's just that last step getting to it. <laughs> I um, knit a shawl for uh, my boyfriend's mother a few years ago, and it was done about a year before it actually got to her. <laughs> and it got to her because he drove out to Texas for it <laughs> and gave it to her. Yeah. So, I'm getting better at <laughs> mailing cards and that, so, yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, since I'm almost finished with this, I am going to be casting on a new project. And it is a yarn pirate um, yarn. It's a three ply. It's super wash merino, and it's four hundred and sixty yards. Was and that a club colorway? Yes, it was a club yeah. colorway. I was. That's what I was trying to figure out which uh, month it is. Oh, it's called Sweet Pea, and mm -hmm. I caked it up last night. So it is pink, purple, and green, and it's really pretty. It I is really, really pretty. pretty. You know, it's super girly, too. It is very girly. No it looks like something girls. that I would make. I know. <laughs> but when I first saw it, when I first got it, I was like, wow, this is kind of fun. <laughs> so, this was, like, I think I was in the club, like, a really long time ago. You were. It's been years. I know. Um, and I still have we were, a lot of her yarn. We were both in, because I was in the club, too, for a little while. Yeah. Um, and then I think you continued I did. after I okay. stopped. Because I was in other clubs, too. And April 2009. Wow. 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 So, I am super excited. <laughs> I have a whole bunch more from when I was in the club, because I was in there, I want to say, like, six months or at, so. I was at least six months. Yeah. Probably more. Because I've used a bunch of her yarn, but I still have a bunch of it. And it, it all the ones I've knit up has been really nice, so. Because didn't we, didn't we at one point... And this is going way back. Didn't we, at one point, we had, when we were both in the club, and we both got the same colorway, because we were both in the club, obviously, yeah. at the same time, um, and we made matching socks. Is that, is that, did that happen? It <laughs> might have. I the would, spring have forward socks. Yes. Um, I think so. My spring forward is in pink and light green. Yes. Okay, then. So yeah. are mine. Yes. Okay. I, that's going way back. Yeah, I... Probably to 2009. <laughs> Spring Forward, which I think is a free pattern from Nitty. Yeah, let me, let me right. Look. I think so. Yeah. Because it, I, yeah, it was a free pattern yeah, for sure. Because um, I enjoy doing, and I've made 4,000 pairs of <laughs> the uh, Pearlless Monkeys um, by Cookie A, and then someone else like went in and changed it so it's pearl. you don't have to pearl. And, um, I don't like the pearls, though. See, I don't. And I like how it looks. I don't like how it looks. Like, I don't mind doing them. I just don't like how it looks. I like. I think it, it looks smoother, I think, without them. I don't know. It's too much texture. Yeah, it's more a pop. Like yeah. That. Yeah, that's, that's yeah, our different I don't know. personalities. <laughs> so, so, anyway, but the spring forward is kind of like, I think that for a while there, because everyone was making monkey socks, and then the spring forward came out, and everyone made spring forward socks, because I made a couple pairs of those, too. And that's a cute pattern, too. I'll have to think about making another pair of those whenever I make another pair of socks. <laughs> Apparently, I don't have it on my Ravelry. <laughs> you know what? It might be on my Ravelry. Yeah, that's... From it's going to be looking way too much yeah. into it. <laughs> so, sorry. I don't know. But anyway, I, yeah. I think that that's what we did. Because we were like, let's make matching socks. Because we have matching yarn. I remember when I was making it, I did them single. Mm -hmm. Which I normally do two at a time. Yeah. Because I don't know why, but from one sock to the other, my tension will just go completely wonky. <laughs> only if it's the situation that I'm working in. And one fit me great, and the other one was like a midget. I thought that those were your monkey socks. Or oh, something. that happened to my monkeys oh, too. And some and jaywalkers and some. <laughs> no, the jaywalkers just didn't fit me. Oh, at all. okay. I ended up burping those out and yeah. redoing them. Okay. So. I don't know. Well, I guess I need to visit swatch. down memory lane there. Yeah. You know, it's what happens when we improv. <laughs> but um, <laughs> I haven't figured out which pattern to make the mm -hmm. shawl out of the sweet pea, so we'll end up having to work on that. Yes, I'd like to have it to cast on for tonight, so I can have a little bit done for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So that's all I have. I think that's all I have too. Um, 
I know I have been watching, um, what have I been watching? Well, Under, Thrones. Under the Dome, I'm all caught up on, and, mm. um, Falling Skies, I'm caught up on that too. <laughs> and, uh, Project Runway comes back, I think, in two weeks, which is very exciting, because it's, like, regular Project Runway, not All Stars. And then, um, oh, and then, Sandy, I have to watch this coming season, which also comes in about two weeks, of America's Next Top Model, because <laughs> it's, like, men and women models, and one of the male models is deaf and signs, so I have to watch that. Are they going to have an interpreter? I don't know. I would, I would assume so, and I think that would be really cool to see. So, um, anyway, so that's coming up, and, yeah, I have three more episodes left to watch of Game of Thrones. <laughs> Because we watched an episode last night. Not that, I mean, I already know what's going to happen, but whatever. I still have to sit and you watch You might that. not know all of it. No, I think I do know all of it. But I don't okay. know that you do. I think or I don't. do. But anyway. <laughs> You'll have to watch to find out. <laughs> and then I'll be like, I knew this. <laughs> but um, the, I don't know when we're going to finish those three episodes because I have to go do some workshops and... Then, when we get back from that, uh, my husband's taking a little time off of work for a couple days when, when we're back in town, and so maybe we can get it done then. Yeah. Yes. And That'll I think we, we also might go out to the movie theater and do some other stuff. I don't know. He wants to go. There's a new Bass Pro Shops coming that's opening, like, next week, and he is, like, hardcore excited for it. And he's like, and then, when we get back from our trip... We can go to the best pro shops, and I'm like, and then you can go by yourself. I'm, I'm not gonna <laughs> lie, that's kind of exciting. For me too. Yeah, no, I don't like the best pro shops. I'll be like, and then you can drop me off at a store nearby because <laughs> I think it's out near the mall. But um, which mall? Uh, Brandon Mall. Oh, okay. Yeah. So oh, yeah, yeah, we talked about this yeah. the other day. So um, I don't know, but he's like so excited about this store opening next week. <laughs> And we're not going to be here for it, so. <laughs> yeah. Yep. I don't know. But I think that's pretty much it. Um, I think since last time I have made it through, oh, I sat down and I finally watched The Incredible Hulk. <laughs> yeah, that, <laughs> one was, that was a whole like ordeal for making her. Making me, I was like stuck on my list forever because of The Incredible Hulk. And then I watched Thor, and I haven't really watched any else on the list since then. Like, I stopped at Thor. So I have... A bunch more of the of Marvel movies to watch and catch up on, and um, yeah, I um, watched a few more episodes of Falling Skies. Season and, one, yes, yeah, season one. <laughs> I'm still in season one, <laughs> and How I Met Your Mother because uh -huh. I am rewatching the beginning seasons because I never finished the show. Oh. <laughs> so I don't know how it ends, so so don't tell me. I already told you I was disappointed in the ending, but when it happened, I told yeah, you. Yeah, but I don't know what it is, so. <laughs> so I'm cool. I'm cool. Yeah. Um, and that's about it. I mean, Josh and I, we watch our normal fail army stuff, <laughs> because that's what we do. <laughs> and cops, and yep. um, I haven't made him watch any psych recently. So he's on a little break from that. <laughs> I, I think we, I said last time we watched Sharknado, but we never got around to Sharknado 2. And Sharknado 3 came out just a couple days ago. I haven't watched it yet, though. Yeah. I think it came out on Thursday. Because yes. my Facebook was full of people posting about Sharknado. And apparently in Sharknado 3, um, George R. R. Martin, who writes the Game of Thrones books, makes a guest cameo. Really? Yes. Well, because I saw something on BuzzFeed about it, and he was, and and the director or whatever was like, and I'm so glad we get to have him because that takes him away from writing his book, ha ha ha. Because now I guess the TV show is caught up with the books, and they're waiting for him to write his next book, and blah blah blah. So. I thought that they were going to be diverging from the book at this point. I think they are. I think that's what I've heard. For the Game of Thrones. Yeah. So I don't know. Oh, and apparently though, there's going to be a Sharknado four. <laughs> <laughs> I am excited that they did announce uh, Jurassic Park, unless I just didn't read the whole article. No, they did. Jurassic okay. World. Yeah. It's now Jurassic World, you know, but it's Jurassic World 2, yeah. which will be coming out in June of 2018. Yeah. So we have a little while to wait on that one. But I'm Chris, so excited. Chris Pratt is returning, from what we've heard, you know, in his role, so that'll be pretty cool. Yes. Yes. So that's exciting. Mm -hmm. Um... I haven't caught up on 
undisclosed. So I am up through. There was an addendum I think that came out this Monday, and I haven't listened to that. I'm still listening to uh, about his arrest. Oh, okay. Well, that was so. just like from last. Week. You're only like a week behind. Yeah, yeah. Because it's been crazy. And that one was um, over an hour. That episode, the arrest one, because I know it took me several days to get through it because I was listening to it. Because uh, I'm, you know, not really having long distances or anything to drive. <laughs> Long distance, you know, like 20 minutes or whatever. So I'm having to listen, I've ha- been having to listen to it while I walk the dog, and my dog, like, walks around, like, one building. It's like, okay, it's too hot out here, I'm done. So. Yeah, my dog, <laughs> when we go for a walk, it's like, oh, let's go a little bit longer. <laughs> hey, we've gone two miles. I just want some water to refill, and then let's go another two. <laughs> yeah, in the evening when it's not as hot, and I take her out, and I'm like, nope, one more building. Come on, one more building. And she's like, <sighs> Because she has really, really small legs. Her legs are not that small. They're like, like that. <laughs> That's about the same. <laughs> so, That's not and she's very word. furry. <laughs> yeah, my dog's legs are about as long as mine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I guess that's about yeah. it, isn't it? Look at us, twenty six something. And now we're going to ramble for a few minutes, because <laughs> um, that's typical. Uh, actually, no, we're not. <laughs> because, I don't know about you, but I would like to um, take a shower soon. Yes, I need to go. we uh, worked out. And we took, laser tag. We took two classes this morning, and, you know, kind of kind of gross. I need to make sure that I'm beating everybody on my Fitbit, too. And then, and then I have to go, and then I have to go make some more crispy treats, because that's what one does. After they work out really hard. <laughs> yes. They're going to be delicious. Yes. So anyway, um, I guess, oh, and I don't have, we don't have our notes, so I don't have my normal stuff. But you can find us <laughs> on Twitter under uh, Two Crafty Stitches, and we are also on Instagram and Ravelry individually as Knits and Bits and Pearly Girl 75 and um youtube yes youtube <laughs> youtube is where you find our videos um under two crafty stitches I don't, we don't usually talk about youtube though that's what no, I'm just no. totally <laughs> off. okay we're the blog yes <laughs> which is two crafty stitches dot wordpress dot com yes dot com. yes and crafty <laughs> is spelled with a k yes like kelly yes <laughs> We did that on purpose. Yes, we did, because Stitches is spelled with an S, like Sandy. So, because we're clever. <laughs> and, and I think we've got a bit of the gym brain happening right now. And I don't know if that's a real thing, but... <laughs> it should be. It, it, it should be. Um, we'll have to Google that. And <laughs> let you all know. Um, okay, that's your job. Okay. <laughs> so, anyway, um, thank you for joining us on our madness of whatever... And we will see you again in a few weeks, and happy crafting! Happy crafting!